Hey guys, so the hubby just got done with the meeting. I'm gonna go meet him for lunch. Just changed my gym clothes. I'm gonna head over to the hotel gym in just a second here, but I'm just gonna show you. I'm gonna be taking my lunch with me. Um, and as you can see, I have my little fridge. So I had prepackaged some of my food, so I'm just gonna grab my asparagus and chicken. And then I'm going to grab a sweet potato since it's lunchtime. And that's about it. So I'm going to take that with me. And, um, yeah, let me just show you what I'm wearing because I'm wearing some gym clothes. And I found a full length mirror. So I'm just wearing my Legion of Boom tank that I had cut up. And I'm liking how I cut this one up. I cut it in the back. Um, and then I've got my Piba leggings on, the mermaid ones, and my Nikes. Yeah, my little BCBG Marshalls bracelet. I had them off to the gym, or off to meet my hubby, and then off to the gym. So, I'll see you guys with me. We're going to this um, barbecue restaurant that um, Top Gun was filmed at. The part where they're like singing. So, that should be fun. We'll see.
Well, that was an awesome workout. I did chest and biceps. I tried to film a little bit of it. It's fun to use different equipment. And I did the treadmill on a 15 incline for 45 minutes. I have to make up some cardio tomorrow because we have to meet for dinner. But I am happy. I feel much better. Time to enjoy the evening. Hey guys, so we ended up finding a little coffee shop and I ate my food and the hubby just had like a tuna sandwich. Um, that barbecue place was not, didn't look good. The, yeah. <laughs> so, anyways, I'm just walking around. I'm loving this little, it's called like Seacorp Plaza or something. Um, and then this part is like the jail, their old jail cells. There was this little craft fair and stuff and it's really cute. I'm gonna go grab me some Starbucks and um, walk around, so I'm gonna take you guys with me. All right guys, this thing is really cool. Oh look, after the gym, that works. So I invented this thing because I traveled every week and I was sick and tired of taking too long to pack or my jewelry getting tangled. So it's so easy, you just lay your jewelry out. The magic is in the liner. The liner grips, cushions, protects, separates your jewelry, keeping it tangle free. There's a pocket, you can put small stuff in there. So that's it. So oh, quick how and easy. Cute is that? You what just is... roll it up and you tie it. Now, oh what happens when it's in your suitcase or your gym bag? It gets jostled, right? Well, everything gets tangled with most other nice products. You. Thank you. That's wonderful. But it's with so Blingzy, cool. everything oh, stays I love in its it. place. Oh, what is it called? Blingzy? Yes, but the best oh, part I love about it. it, this product is sewn for me by four trafficked women who live in North County in a safe house. After they sew it, they place this bookmark in. This was so important to me. The bookmark tells their story of being trafficked. Oh, they're from other it. countries, but they're now making their life here. And this sewing project has given them um, additional self-esteem boosting and opportunity to heal and become more independent quicker. On the other side, it talks about Hope House. Hope House is the safe house run by two nuns, and it's so cool. Oh my God, so I love it. So it comes with these five gorgeous faux suede animal-free mm -hmm. colors. This one is called um, Red Hot Lover. It has navy inside. Purple Passion has a black liner. The one you see in front of you is Chocolate Delight with teal. We have Martini Olive with taupe. And Indigo Girl has coral. Oh my God, So I there's love something it. for everyone. I absolutely love it. Very cool, this is very cool, guys. I might have to get this. You guys see my jewelry and it's all over the place usually. <laughs> all right, guys, Cassandra's I'm gonna be getting one of these. So I'm gonna get the red and it has blue inside. And then I will post some pictures on the blog um, for you guys to see it. And I'll even put some of my jewelry on it and show you what kind of jewelry I take on vacation. How about that? Um, so yeah, yay. And then it, that one has the bookmark on it too, right? Yes, and I will give you one there of these. It's a microfiber wipe for your oh, glasses yes. or your jewelry. Oh, and they, my glasses are always dirty. You guys Whatever are you always want. telling me that. <laughs> <laughs> Very cool. Yay, thank you. What is the name of your channel? Um, it's called Thrifters Anonymous. It's oh, one of them. Yeah. I like that. Name. For a bunch of thrifters <laughs> who uh, are addicted. And uh, my other channel is just my name, Shayna Emily. It's um, like health and fitness and oh, beauty. Yeah. All right, guys, I'm at another place. What is the name of this? Pure Up Here. Pure Up Here. Oh, I love it. Is that? It's Ilocano. It's Ilocano, a, okay. It's a dialect. It oh, I love it. Flutter when hanging loose. Very cool. Well, as you guys see, I stopped here because look at this headscarf. And tell me again, it is made. It's hand woven fabric that's on a loom. Oh my so God, I love it. Artisans in small villages in the Philippines, they hand make it. And I love how it's like. It's very detailed. Tied in the back like that. Oh my goodness. I'm kind of in love with this. And these are just the head. Um, yes, the head wraps. Yeah. And these cute little bows. Love it. These are kids' scarves that actually have a Velcro. Oh my gosh. So it doesn't become a choking hazard for kids. Oh There's yeah. Oh my gosh, I love it. How cute are these cups? These are all handmade. Very cute. One of a kind vintage repurposed jewelry. I love it. I used to be that and then I used to be obsessed with blankets. 
then I can talk to you back. Yes, please. This one's really cute and it's just a key. These are little shotgun shells that she just put stuff on. Really cute. This is, I'm assuming, a bullet. Cute stuff. Having these like bullet shells, you guys can see it. This one has like a key on it. All right, guys, I found the origin of where I'm at because I didn't know. I just kept saying I was at a craft fair. <laughs> Welcome to the SoCal Etsy Guild Market. I love it, and you can hashtag it, guys. Maybe I will. I already bought a few things, and I'm thinking about getting this necklace here, the music one. But anyways, tell me. So you started the guild? Yeah, I started the guild about two and a half years ago. Um, we have over 2,200 members based all throughout Southern California. And okay, Southern California, listen in. And um, we go as far north as Oxnard and as far south as the border. We put on events all throughout. We do seminars, meetups, information meetings, vending events, all different kinds of things. I love it. This is my favorite thing to do. Look for treasures. And you guys all know that, right? <laughs> Hence the Thrifters Anonymous <laughs> name. Anyways, very cool. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, and she makes, by the way, she makes all these things I just showed you over there. So, very, I love it. And I love that you made, like, part of the... It's vintage music paper, yeah. so it's one of a kind. Love it. And I have all right, guys, look at this, like, Wonder Woman and I started doing it. And I How really cute is that? Really love it. It's really cute. Really <laughs> <laughs> like, Do I need it? Now it's, I have a question. Like Do you have others like this? Because my son plays trombone. So, so these are a little small. Right, so this is that old gel cell. Apparently this is the restroom. Oh my god, this is so cool. These are all the prisoners. Hey guys, so I'm back in the hotel room. I just had the best time um, at that uh, little craft show. And um, I got to meet some really, um, really nice people and um, great vendors. And I feel like I've, I found some really fun finds. I figured I would show you guys really quick. Uh, but I'm going to do a post on my blog so that you guys can see. But um, the first one I found that you guys uh, saw me go to was Blingzy, which is um, the jewelry holder that I uh, stopped at. And... I got the red one with the blue inside, so um, like I said, I'm going to take some pictures and put it on the blog, but I just, I loved the whole idea of it. I love the fact that they're handmade. I love that there's um, a story, and um, obviously all these women, uh, they talk about um, human trafficking and some of their stories, and I just, I was really inspired by it, and I thought it was a really cute um, idea. Of course, you know, you could probably make some of these yourself, um, but what a great idea, what a great gift. So I'm excited to use this and then I will show you guys my jewelry that I have and I'll end up putting it in here. So I'll show it to you. Um, and um, like I said, that's by Blingzy and I'm going to leave the website down below and I think she's going to offer me a, um, coupon for you guys. So I think I may be able to get 15% off. Just use my name, Shana15 on her site and then you can get 15% off. So I will um, link that down below. Um, the next place I stopped was a beautiful um, hand. These were all handmade and this one in particular was 16 bucks and it's by um, Pirapir. I think I'm saying that right, Pirapir. Um, I believe it's Filipino and they are all um, handcrafted, handmade um, by a loom. And I fell in love with this mustard. I just love like mustard color, but it's a head wrap and I cannot wait to wear it. And I'm in love with it. It's gorgeous. They had all different colors. I was torn between a couple, but this is the one that kind of inspired me originally. So 
I got that. And then I found um, the woman who actually started the whole Etsy guild, which by the way, here it is, the SoCal Etsy guild. You can find them on Facebook and Twitter and Instagram. Um, but I found this Wonder Woman necklace, vintage, amazing, gorgeous. Like this is gonna be like my fall staple piece. And then um, I got this necklace that was handmade by um, Real Music Paper. And um, just music notes. I, I play the viola, if you guys don't know. Um, so And the piano I used to play, but mostly the viola. But it says my heart. It just has music, so it's just a long necklace. So I will leave a link down below for all of these guys. So excited to share, and I just love stories behind things. I mean, I'm a thrifter, you know. That's what I do, so... Anyways, I am off to the gym to get a workout in, and then the hubby and I are going to go out to dinner and have a good night. There's a, a jazz festival here as well, so I am loving this whole area. Go San Diego. All right. I'll take you guys with me to the gym. All right, bye. Hey, guys. So I am just getting ready to head downstairs. Um, the hubby is downstairs already. I guess I can show you what I'm wearing, so let me do that. It's really nothing exciting, to be honest with you. Um, you can even see me. I'm just wearing this white um, PJK tank I got at Marshall's. I'm wearing my Jessica Simpson shoes. I love these jeans or gap jeans. I'm getting the sun so you can see with these little zippers. And then I'm wearing some lipstick because I felt like it. And I have my little kimono. Let me put this on. So it gets chilly outside so I just brought my little kimono and that is what I'm wearing. And it's awesome. The problem is, is that her diet, the, uh, oh my God, they gave me a mini raspberry jello dish. Yeah.